Arsphenamine, Wikipedia article audio. Arsphenamine, also known as Salversan or Compound 606, is a drug that was introduced at the beginning of the 1910s as the first effective treatment for syphilis, and was also used to treat trypanosomiasis. This organoarsenic compound was the first modern chemotherapeutic agent. Arsphenamine was first synthesized in 1907 in Paul Ehrlich's lab by Alfred Bertheim. The antisyphilitic activity of this compound was discovered by Sahakiro Hata in 1909, during a survey of hundreds of newly synthesized organic arsenical compounds. Ehrlich had theorized that by screening many compounds, a drug could be discovered that would have antimicrobial activity but not kill the human patient. Ehrlich's team began their search for such a magic bullet among chemical derivatives of the dangerously toxic drug Atoxyl. This project was the first organized team effort to optimize the biological activity of a lead compound through systematic chemical modifications, the basis for nearly all modern pharmaceutical research. History Structure Arsphenamine was used to treat the disease syphilis because it is toxic to the bacterium Treponema pallidum, a spirochete that causes syphilis. Arsphenamine was originally called 606 because it was the sixth in the sixth group of compounds synthesized for testing. It was marketed by Hookst AG under the trade name Salversan in 1910. Salversan was the first organic antisyphilitic, and a great improvement over the inorganic mercury compounds that had been used previously. It was distributed as a yellow, crystalline, hygroscopic powder that was highly unstable in air. This significantly complicated administration, as the drug had to be dissolved in several hundred milliliters of distilled, sterile water with minimal exposure to air to produce a solution suitable for injection. Some of the side effects attributed to salversan, including rashes, liver damage, and risks of life and limb, were thought to be caused by improper handling and administration. This caused Ehrlich who worked assiduously to standardize practices, to observe, the step from the laboratory to the patient's bedside, is extraordinarily arduous and fraught with danger. Ehrlich's laboratory developed a more soluble arsenical compound, Neosalversan, which was easier to prepare, and it became available in 1912. Less severe side effects such as nausea and vomiting were still common. An additional problem was that both salversan and neosalversan had to be stored in sealed vials under a nitrogen atmosphere to prevent oxidation. These arsenical compounds were supplanted as treatments for syphilis in the 1940s by penicillin. After leaving Ehrlich's laboratory, Hata continued parallel investigation of the new medicines in Japan. Salversan has long been assumed to have an as equals as double bond, akin to the N equals N linkage in azobenzene. However, in 2005, in an extensive mass spectral analysis Salversan was shown to have as as single bonds, not as equals as double bonds. The drug was also found to be a mixture consisting of cycloas 3 and cycloas 5 species.